while it might seem very ironical that your generalism Jimodism doesn't really like the over commercialistic shopping holiday of Black Friday he's also one of the Black Friday's best customer because you see like the entire year I don't buy almost anything in um, tech way no I sit and wait see what I want and on Black Friday I buy all the stuff I need um, like sometimes I need to shop a panic pack of more RAM to be able to make more videos but um, usually I just wait for Black Friday to get much cheaper prices so this is my little Black Friday shopping haul and unboxing of my new monitor so I won't show you in much detail exactly you know all the other stuff but my very nice mouse, um, mouse with a lot of buttons is good not, but not for FPS so I picked this one up I got the rival 310 310 uh, because it fits very nice in the hand and I think it will be a little bit better in FPS game because I noticed with my beautiful beautiful uh, Corsair ma mouse and um, I tend to press too many buttons it's really crazy sometimes so that's you know I thought it would be good and backup has always been a problem so they had a huge discount on an 8 terabyte external drive so um, now I hope I will be able to back up more of my videos because um, some of them I just end up deleting when they're uploaded because space and so there we have that solved that problem also you might be thinking to yourself Jimodism it was a good while ago you reached 10,000 subscribers where is the thank you for 10,000 subscribers video and I would say uh, soon I don't really know exactly what to do for it but I know one thing I posted on the community tab like a week ago two weeks ago a little post that uh, told everyone that you can contribute fan art to the channel if you want to uh, for the celebration of the 10,000 subscribers and I'll throw that in that video whatever we will do at that time but we will have a little um, milestone video of course and uh, if you want to send that in then the due time is 15th of December so you need to have sent it in before 15th 1-5 of December uh, and you can send it to me by a personal message in the discord or you can uh, put it in an email to jimodism at gmail.com anyways let's go through with the unboxing of my new monitor I don't know if I told you I have um, I use a television as a monitor it's uh, 32 inches but it's a television so the, the, the delay is like horrible um, OBS tells me what happens in the game before my monitor does so my secondary monitor with OBS is faster than my main monitor that tells you something so I thought what the heck I need another monitor maybe it will improve my Battlefield 2 results so I've been looking for this monitor like the entire year uh, not the entire since summer I've been watching this display and then I thought I'll buy it soon I'll buy it soon and then I thought shit there is like two months left to Black Friday and then I said oh what the heck let's wait and it was worth it I saved a lot of money maybe like hundred dollars which is very nice so here we have it I decided to buy this thing AOC CO3 twin this fucking hell AOC C0 or O I don't know 32 G1 and it's of course a 30 inch display so it's as large as my current television but it's 144 Hertz and it's one millisecond delay also has uh, a free sync so my current television doesn't have stuff like that of course it's a television come on anyways where is it my racer 
Haven't looked at it. Not even a sneak peek. Alright. Such a huge thing. Enormous. Oof. Here we have a HDMI cable. Some stickers and shit. CD-ROM. Display port cable, power cable, all right. Damn, it's not easy to get space to do this. I like, holy shit, it's pretty huge. The sound is terrible. Smaller than I expected. Well, that's nice. Hope it's enough. So here we have parts of the stand. The wall. This is actually my first monitor I bought. All the other monitors are like inherited from friends and stuff, so or found. So it's pretty cool, I think. I'm not the wasteful guy, so I hope this will. I hope I won't be needing to buy a monitor in like a long time. It's also 100, uh, 1440 hertz. Uh, yeah, 1440p, so it's a 2K monitor. Here we have it. It looks pretty fine. That is cool. Okay, let's just check beneath here. We got some package stuff. Wanna be careful with my monitor. We have a little power consumption sticker thing. Don't need that. Wow. So, how do you think it looks so far? I think it looks pretty cool, but... Um, I mean, it is as big as my current display, but my current display looks bigger because it has a thick edge around it, being television and all. thing. years ago I was the kind of guy that kind of kept the uh, info stickers like forever and, like to make things things feel more fresh or something I completely stopped doing that now I'm like reverse okay here we have the foot better get my razor going cut the packaging I just hope it's not defect or something, like the screen. Cool. 
Okay, so we have a little wing thing here, so we can mount it. We can set it on this piece here. Pretty straightforward. Yep, it's like mounted. Then we have we have screws there, but it seems oh okay I see we're just mounting it like that. So we have screws if we want to mount it on another thing. Oh. Seems to be looking good. Yeah. This is pretty cool. Of course I'll do some test videos or something. But uh, basically, unboxing complete. So I hope you enjoyed this little video. And I will get my new monitor, my backup drive and get more used to my rival mouse. And uh, hopefully this will make me being able to make better and better videos. Anyways, keep tuned, subscribe if you haven't, like the video if you did enjoy it, dislike it if you did not. Anyways, I'll see you next time. This is Jim with this Motor Channel, signing out. Whoosh.